For today's video, we will compare two CPUs, namely the Intel Celeron N3020 and AMD A6 6400K. Before proceeding to the analysis, let us first know more about Intel Celeron N4020. Intel Celeron N4020 is one of the most budget-friendly and power-efficient laptop processors. The 6-watt chip for affordable laptops isn't as fast as the popular 15-watt mid-range CPUs such as those from the Intel Core U and AMD Ryzen U series. But the Intel Celeron N4020 can be a decent solution for many laptop users who don't regularly do heavy tasks like video editing. It can handle fairly well web browsing, work on office documents, media playback, and other daily computing tasks. As for gaming, the Intel UHD 600 graphics of the Celeron N4020 is one of the weakest solutions. It can be only used for the lightest games. As we can see on the table, my laptop CPU which is Intel Celeron N4020 has a benchmark of 361, while AMD A6 6400K is at 370 benchmark. Now, let us proceed to the analysis and comparison of these two CPUs. Intel Celeron N4020 is from the family of Intel Celeron and the CPU growth of Intel Celeron 34,000, N4000, and N5000. It is on its ninth generation. Its architecture is mainly of Gemini Lake and its segment is mobile, while AMD A6-6400K is from the family of AMD A, CPU group of AMD A6-6000, it is on its third generation and its architecture is Richland file driver and its segment is either desktop or server. In terms of CPU cores and base, they almost have the same cores, threads, core architecture, and hyper-threading. The only difference is the overdocking which the AMD A6-6400K has it. As for the memory and PCIe, the memory of the Intel Celeron N4020 is DDR4-2400 while the AMD is DDR3-1866. The two have the same memory channels of 2, while the bandwidth of the Intel Celeron is at 38.4 gigabytes per second. Uh, the two CPUs don't have ECC. The L3 cache of the Intel Celeron is 4.00 MB while the AMD is only at 1 MB. As for the internal graphics, the Intel Celeron N4020 has the GPU of Intel UHD Graphics 600, the GPU frequency of 0.20 GHz, GPU Turbo of 0.65 GHz. GPU generation is at 9.5 while the technology used is 14 nanometer. The maximum display is at 3. The execution unit is 12. It has a shader of 96 and the maximum GPU memory of 8 gig. And the direct X version is 12. As for the AMD A6 6400K, it has the GPU of AMD Radeon HD 8470D, a GPU frequency of 0.80 GHz from a generation of 5. The technology is 32 nanometer. The maximum display of 2. Execution unit is 3. It has 192 shader. It has a maximum GPU memory of 2 GB. And its direct X version is 11.2. And for their additional details about thermal management and technical details is attached here. Now let us proceed to the productivity benchmarking. Based on IGPU-FP32 performance, single precision GFLOPs, it is a theoretical computing performance of the internal graphics unit of the processor with simple accuracy of 32 bit in GFLOPs. GFLOPs indicate how many billion floating point operation the IGPU can perform per second. As we can see in the diagram, the Intel Celeron N4020 has 125 or just 41% while the AMD A6 6400K has 307 or at 100%. Next up is Geekbench 5 64-bit multi-core. 
It is a cross-platform benchmark that heavily used the system's memory. A fast memory will push the result a lot. The multi-core test involves all CPU cores and has a big advantage of hyper-threading. And according to Geekbench 5, the Intel Celeron N4020 has a higher percentage of 100% or 896 benchmark compared to AMD A6-6400K, which only has 723 or 81%. And lastly, Cinebench R15 Multicore. It is the successor of Cinebench 11.5 and is also based on the Cinema 4's suite. Cinema 4 is a worldwide used software to create 3D forms. The multi-core test involves all CPU cores and thus a big advantage of hyper-threading. Intel Celeron N4020 gives off a higher mark which is 144 or at 100% while AMD A6-6400K has no percentage. As for the gaming benchmark, it shows that Intel Celeron N4020 has 358.9 benchmark in the game Minecraft while A6-6400K of AMD has 947.2 which is higher compared to Celeron N4020. On the game Counter-Strike, AMD A6-6400K has 349.3 benchmark compared to Celeron N4020 which only has 39 benchmark points. As for the Grand Theft Auto 5 or GTA 5, the Intel Celeron N4020 has a benchmark point of 36.8 while the AMD A6-6400K is only at 26.4 benchmark points. For the cost to performance analysis, based on the comparison of the two CPUs, the AMD A6-6400K and the Intel Celeron N4020, it shows that among two CPUs or two processors, the more powerful in terms of raw computational ability test is the AMD A6-6400K. In terms of overall gaming performance, the AMD A6-6400K also rise above. And also, AMD A6-6400K proven to be more cost-effective compared to Celeron N4020. As the data also shows that the speed rank of the Intel Celeron N4020 is at 1,266 out of 1,347 while the AMD A6-6400K is at 931 out of 1347.